If you watched last week's video, we toured a shipping container home on the side of a mountain. The views are awesome. This is the second shipping container home with the same views on the same mountain, and we're gonna be taking a tour of this today. So let's go check it out. Welcome back to On The Rocks, which is right outside Chattanooga, Tennessee, 30 minutes south. It's actually over the border, so we are in Georgia, right at the very top of Georgia, on top of an incredible mountain with the best views. If you saw last week's video, you'll get a gist of what this is all about. This is the other shipping container home on the property that you can book yourself. It is a single 20-foot shipping container home, so it's only 160 square feet, I believe, and it is true a tiny home. You can book this spot or check out last week's video and book that spot as well or you can book both. If you book both you can have two couples come here and really have the time of your life or uh, a small family or anything like that and experience tiny home living in my favorite type of container home. So the links are down below to book it. There's also a link to sign up on Airbnb and a link to host your own unique home if you ever desire to build a unique Airbnb. Anyway, whenever you arrive here to On The Rocks, the hosts are super nice and friendly. You'll have no issues with that. And you come down here and you'll see that there's two tiny homes on the slot. We did a tour of the one on the left. Now let's head down, walk down this walkway and go to the one on the right, which is the gray shipping container home. And just the way the shipping container home stands out amongst its environment and it looks with the background, the background's endless, because we're basically on the edge of this cliff. We're not too close to the edge at all. Actually, you could walk around and everything and be fine, but it's really neat having this rock facing cliff right here, and you are on top of that with your tiny house. One side is your shipping container home. The other side is actually your deck that faces the cliff side, and this deck has a lot to offer. So let's just take a walk up this deck. It is all this beautiful wood, and you have a couple chairs right here on the right, and the best thing I think is the swinging bed over here at the end of this you can chill out here lounge read books this is definitely the favorite spot of this listing and of course you got the beautiful endless views you can see how the buildings down there and cars and the mountains uh, whenever I was here it was pretty rainy so we saw all the clouds go through the town and it's like we're basically above the clouds you feel like you're on top of the world it is incredible so this is the deck area you can enjoy it all the views come out here drink some coffee and of course the day bed below this tiny home is just the storage area and everything it looks really cool from the drone perspective though it looks like a pretty large container home but that, that's just storage and if we go up back onto the deck we'll walk into the front door right here into your shipping container home now this is only 160 square feet so there's only so much you can do with such a tiny space very similar layout to what we've seen before but it works apparently over on the left side you have your bed and it's a pretty large bed for this container home and you actually have nightstands on each side and over here on this wall this is the ship left wall you have a cool window this is where your ac unit is and over in front of the bed is another kind of bar window that lets you overlook the views as well. So this is kind of one half of your shipping container home. Underneath is storage under the bed. Of course, you can put all your clothes and luggage and everything like that down below there. The white walls make it feel larger than what it is. And I love the wood floors in here. This feels really modern. I love the style and it just feels really nice in this container your home and doesn't feel like you're in an awkward little box that people might think a lot of people don't understand why people build with container homes but it's because it's unique it looks awesome it is eye-catching and it works you already got the shell and after talking to the owner of this one because he built them himself so props to him did an incredible job uh, he enjoys working with uh, shipping containers so that's why I believe people like them a lot now a quick word from our sponsor. This video is sponsored by Surfshark. Surfshark is an app or browser extension that basically lets you place your laptop or cell phone anywhere in the world as if you were in that country. This lets you access websites or unblock content that you may not be able to see. It also adds more security when you're online to keep your passwords and such safe. 
I love using Surfshark because it is much safer when using public Wi-Fi, which we have all used before. Because Surfshark will encrypt all of your online data. And it also has an ad blocking feature when you're on the internet. And you can also access streaming content like Netflix shows that are only available in other countries from your home. All you have to do is use Surfshark to change your virtual location. So use my code Levi Kelly to get 84% off plus four extra months for free. Surfshark offers a 30 day money back guarantee so there's no risk for trying it out yourself. Links are in the description below. Now let's get back to the tour. Now onto the middle of this area, you have your kitchen. So you have the countertop, quartz countertop, and everything facing this side of the wall. Uh, and over here, you have a built-in hot plate, actually, so you can boil some water for your coffee whenever you want to go in that swinging bed outside. And we can just continue along. You got uh, a couple snacks that they offer. You got your tiny house sink right here in the middle. And then over on the right of all of this countertop, you have your coffee and you have a little s'mores making kit because there is a fire outside. Over here on this right side, you actually have a small shelf, but you might notice that this table does swing up. So in tiny house, it is pretty common to have collapsible furniture. So you just swing up this small table and you pull out these two chairs and now you have a small seating area to eat or work or whatever. To save space, you'll just close it right back up and store it right underneath. Continuing on with the rest of this tiny home, you slide open this door and you enter your bathroom. You have your small vanity and sink. You have a mirror right above it toilet in the middle and then your tiled shower over to the left even the floor is tiled I love the tiling work in here it's gorgeous and yeah this is just your small very very functional bathroom taking a step back onto the outside we'll walk down to your fire pit area you might notice that there's twinkle lights and everything that lead up to it I love the look of that whenever it's twilight or hitting nighttime these lights light up the place and they lead you all the way down to your fire pit which is pretty close to the edge of the cliff, which is awesome. You can sit out here, have a fire with your friends and or family, and just overlook the town that you can see from here and just have a great time out here with your friends. And it feels pretty private out here as well. Like I said, you're on top of the world. It is a pretty moody, foggy day today and the couple days I was here, but that just adds cozy vibes for this container home. What do you think of this container home and the views and where this is located? I truly wanna know what you think, so comment down below and I read all the comments. So that is your container home. If you wanna book here, the link is down below. I like this one a lot because it is in such a unique space and the views you have and it's like tiny home. Come stay here, book here, subscribe to my channel, send this video to somebody and be like, hey, let's go check out this place and even book the other shipping container home. And you'll have the whole place to yourself and that would be a really fun getaway for you. So thank you for watching this video. Next week, there'll be another Airbnb video, so stay on the lookout for that. Get some merch and guys, thanks for watching.